Alright, what up y'all? So uh we are back. I went ahead and took the core pack off. So unplugged from each uh spark plug. I went ahead and plugged the passenger side back up to the core pack so it'd be easier to tell, you know, where all of this stuff goes when it's time to go back in there. But uh Yeah, so all of that's out the way. Uh fuel lines disconnected it was a eight millimeter bolt down there holding this little bracket piece in so got that out fuel line is loose right here so now it's just four 10 millimeter bolts holding the fuel reel once i get those out uh it'll be time to unhook each of the fuel injectors get those unhooked and then this whole line should come up i think everything else is out the way so kind of have to wiggle it around this but i should be able to lift it up and pull it that way and get that out so once i get that out then uh yeah i think i gotta take all of this off to get these heads off so that's gonna suck but uh yeah gotta be done fast forward a little bit uh, fuel rails are off, fuel injectors are out, uh, just a heads up, make sure you cover these holes up, uh, I didn't cover them at first because the whole head is coming off anyway, but one of those little o-rings fell inside on one of these, so, you know, I got it out, but the point is, if you're doing this and you're just doing some other stuff like changing injectors at manifold or something cover it up because you don't want to drop anything in there and not be able to reach it but luckily i could reach it and get it out so all of that is uh it's all in here so i got all of them but cover this stuff up ahead of time uh yeah so now i'm about to get these valve covers off it should just be six eight millimeter bolts uh it's these short ones and then it's a couple of where is it these long ones so yeah I don't have a deep socket, so I just got this wrench, but uh, I tested it so I can I can reach all of them with the wrench. Uh, it's not the best, but I can reach it. Turn it around a little bit. So, yeah, I can reach it. So, I'm going to go ahead and take these off and yeah, at least get the valve covers off so I can see what it's looking like in here, you know, in the top half. And then it's going to be a waiting game, waiting for... Uh, whatever tools that I need I still haven't ordered all of that stuff so whatever tools I'm gonna need I still gotta order all the gaskets and all of that but just want to get this out the way for now and then uh, I can focus on some of this other stuff but yeah getting this stuff together all right, so we are officially at the stopping point for uh, this little project valve covers are off as you can tell it is extremely milky in here a little bit more on this side but yeah so definitely got us a problem but i'm gonna go ahead and uh close this down for the day make a list of everything i need and i'm gonna start ordering everything I'm pretty sure all of the stuff on the front gotta come off to get these heads off but yeah, we are broken down pretty good. So, uh, I guess it'd probably be like a week or so before I get back to to this part. So, stick around for whatever else comes up. Might be some vet videos. I'm not sure yet. But, uh, yeah, stick around for that.